lucky enough to experience the elegant big band era you're certainly familiar with Benny Goodman. He tuned his instrument so skillfully he received international fame for blending big band music and jazz to form a style called swing. In doing so, he was honored by the title King of Swing, which brought notoriety to his music and his reeded instrument, the clarinet. Unfortunately, instruments like the clarinet have taken a back seat to more modern day music makers like electric guitar and synthesizers. But you put an instrument like the clarinet in the hands of a master like Rick Rubin, and it's music to anybody's ear. I think it's fantastic. It's the first time I've heard Rick, and um, I do like jazz, but I am a novice. As far as I'm concerned, jazz will never take a back seat to any musical form. Jazz is it. A lot of them just like to have something else to listen to besides what they hear on the radio all the time. Maybe something a little more mellow, something a little more laid back. We have over the last 25 years, we've had a lot of good jazz groups. Rick is one of the best. He's probably one of the best uh, clarinetists that's come into this city. The timing is just right. As today's modern music is becoming increasingly stale, the second generation of jazz greats like Rick are ready to capture a new audience. Man on Music, Dave Turbert for Live on 5.